You know, there's some absolutely amazing medical research happening right here in the Bay Area. And all week this week here at 5, we're getting a great look at how it's now saving lives. Dr. Joe continues her special series with a brand new fix for terminal heart patients. to make her heart attack on December 16th of 2011. Dropped dead on my office floor. Richard Murphy was 40 at the time, and a third of his heart was no longer working. The doctors were telling me he probably won't get out of bed again. Richard's health was getting worse. His last hope was something new. This is really the first device of this kind ever. Dr. Charles Lambert is a cardiologist at Pepin Heart Institute here at Florida Hospital Tampa. He discovered Richard was a candidate for a clinical trial, testing a parachute like no other. It's a big device and it's put in through a catheter, but it's a very large catheter. So the parachute is... Dr. Lambert threads the parachute into an artery and then into the chamber of Richard's heart that's no longer working. I didn't really expect him to feel better right away, but I was, uh, I was amazed he felt better immediately. Over the next year... Cells will grow over the device, allowing it to become one with Richard, keeping his blood flowing, reducing stress on the healthy part of the muscle. So he'll have that for the rest of his life. It's a night and day difference in my attitude, uh, my ability to breathe. I mean, really, my whole outlook. I woke up this morning. It's mind-boggling, really. The difference so profound, Richard sealed it in ink. He has a new tattoo. It reads, born to lose, live to win. How long do you think it will take before people will be offered this option? I think realistically, it's probably going to be a year and a half to two years. You do look good. Precious time Richard and his wife didn't have until now. We can look five and ten years down the road instead of and not know what's going to happen. At least now we have a positive outlook. Thanks to a lifesaver in the form of a parachute. Well, Richard texted me today. He said that he is able to eat dinner with his wife at the dinner table. That's new for him. And also watch television instead of being confined to his bed. That's really amazing. That's yes. awesome. Jill, who is this parachute for? It's for people between the ages of 18 and 79. Here it is right here. People with heart failure that's been caused by a heart attack where the heart has been, muscle has been damaged and can't pump appropriately. Mm, that's amazing. What else do you think is in the works for heart patients? I, I'm still amazed by how delicate this thing is. It is so, it's like you can't even feel it. It really is amazing, the technology here. It, it truly is. And what they're working on also is it's something to stimulate the heart to repair itself. So instead of injecting stem cells, they're placing a drug into the heart now, which makes those cells wake up and repair and then also try to minimize that damage that's done by the heart attack. And Joe, if somebody is looking at a cr clinical trial, what do you suggest they look for? You know, I think that, you know, clinicaltrials.gov is a great place to start. You can search there. You can also call local hospitals. I would talk to your doctor, your primary care doctor, or the specialist as well that's involved. And, you know, really be your own advocate. We've said that over and over again. And really and truly, there are, there's lots out there. Some of them are paid for. There's, it's all inclusive. Other times, you have to have insurance. So those are other things you need to look Ask for. Ask questions and demand answers. Yes. Take yes. control of your own health. Well, we like love I that. said, be your own advocate. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Joe, yeah, thank you. Stuff. Yeah, that's really amazing news. We know you have questions, though, and we've got a way to get some answers right now. Experts from Pepin Heart Center at Florida Hospital Tampa, they're online right now at this moment. And connecting with them is very easy. Just go on to Facebook and like our My Fox Tampa Bay page. It'll say Fox 13 and MyFoxTampaBay.com. Look for this post. Again, this is on Facebook. Reply with your question, and experts are online right now until 6 o'clock, so you've got about 20 minutes left.